Look at this. Them setting that. Look at these potatoes. When, when these I ate huge. a lot of food, um... Hey y'all, welcome back. Our ingrown potatoes are just about ready to harvest. We could probably let them go a little bit longer. They're starting to fall over, but um, the chickens are starting to get into them. So we're just gonna go ahead and pull them. It is muddy as all get out out here, but that's okay. We're gonna wash them before we cure them. So I think it'll be okay. Let's see how many we get. potatoes like this these have been exposed to the light so we're not gonna eat those because supposedly they'll make you sick they'll make your animals sick we're just gonna toss them over the back fence so if you ever wondered how a potato grows this is how the sea potato was under here and it branched out and made these potatoes these could have gone a little bit longer, but since the chickens have been in them, I'm gonna go ahead and harvest them. So here's a good example of one of our seed potatoes. This is, this is what we chitted and planted earlier in the spring. That's pretty good. I'm surprised it hasn't rotted. But you can see it even has, it even still has green growth coming out of it up here, new growth. So I bet if we left that in the ground, it would keep growing. I can tell you, this is a great activity for kids. What other, what other time can we sanction digging in the mud? Lots of these too. The chickens like them. I don't know what they are. Hopefully it'll. Ugh, I don't like it when they start tripping out. Already. 
All right, here's what we got. I'm happy with this. We probably could have done more if we'd let them keep growing, but the chickens were not going to let that happen. And realistically, I mean, we didn't put any effort into this, really. Yeah, Mama. It's been such a wet spring that I we haven't even had to Mama. water these things. So I'm really, really happy with the size of most of them. We're going to take these inside. We're going to rinse them off real good. And then I'm going to put them in a cool, dark place to cure because they will not store like this. They'll rot. So we'll also weigh them while we're at it and we'll see what happens. We put the potatoes in this bucket to make it easier to weigh. So let's see what the final verdict is. What is it? 25 pounds of potatoes. I'm happy with that. How many pounds did we start with? Was it 20? Yeah. I think it was 20 for all three of the beds. There's some good looking potatoes. Whoa. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Whoa.